my lab does coatings and modifying surfaces, so we thought we could help. So I responded saying, what can we do? And that's where it all started. An employee here at KGH made a call for help via Twitter, asking for a way to prevent fogging on face shields. Well, UBCO answered that question by collaborating with Prelabs on finding a simple solution. So the solution is actually to take a, a commercial wipe, a soap that's already available at the hospital, uh, and just to wipe down the inside of the, the mask, and that allows it to become anti-fogging. I came up with the application of uh, surfact, surfact uh, tents and uh, surface active agents and how they, they can be implemented and, and as coatings uh, as a, a simple and fast method uh, for, uh, uh, for uh, making anti-fog surface. It took the team less than a week to come up with a solution from tweet to finish and finding a product the hospital already had was crucial. In order for it to be implemented quickly, it had to be something that was available. So even if I, I said my lab could come up with some solution, but you know that would take six months and they have to go through certification, all that. If it's available at the hospital, they can do it next day. We had to uh, find a, a fast method uh, in order to be able to implement on the product and, uh, and not just about that, uh, even the simplicity of the method and also about the, the, the availability of the material because it, they may not be available anywhere for the applicants. After the success of the solution, the hospital made it a protocol to use it on all masks as fog prevention helps people do their jobs effectively. Also, your hands are probably contaminated, so if you want to wipe down the, the face shield while wearing it, you're going to contaminate the inside of the mask. And so it's a solution that needs to be solved for everyone so that everyone's safer from the virus. How did staff at KGH react? Uh, they were uh, pretty surprised uh, how uh, simple and uh, um, effective this method would be. The solution can be applied to any transparent surface and does not need to be reapplied as long as the surface isn't continuously wiped down or cleaned. Sarita Patel, Castanet News, Kelowna.